In recent days, a better understanding of the benefits and cultivation process of CBD has contributed to a massive surge in popularity and dissolved a decades-long taboo. While this widespread acceptance has brought a new option of relief to millions of grateful people across America, is all CBD created equal? CBD essentially stands for cannabidiol, which is one of the major cannabinoids in the cannabis plant. You know, people hear cannabis and they think, oh my gosh, I'm going to get high if I take this. You're not because it has very low levels of THC. It's going to give you the medical benefits, if you will, but not the psychoactive effect. And that's really the major difference. I've been in the pharmacy industry for the last 15 years as an intern in the pharmacy as well as being a pharmacist. There's such a negative image of just the cannabis industry and so there's a lot of misunderstanding that we as pharmacists as well as healthcare edu educators have to be a proponent in terms of educating the public uh, as well as to explain to them what the differences are. A hemp-based CBD product has been a, a great alternative for patients, uh, especially for patients actually suffering from chronic pain, uh, autoimmune disorders such as MS. Uh, IBS, psoriasis, that's the reason why I'm a proponent for it. This is one of my Boston Terriers, Spud. Uh, most people get to see him as he follows me around the clinic all day long. So veterinary medicine is always um, put to the same standards that human medicine is, so why would it be any different when it comes to CBD? But so far, from what I've been seeing with clients that have been using it and, and coming into the clinic, there's been positive results. With the passing of the 2018 Farm Bill, it's allowed a lot of companies uh, to create the opportunity to get into the space. And with that, um, yes, there's a tremendous amount of excitement that goes behind it, but that I think is creating oversaturation in the market and also creating some worry behind a lot of the leaders in the industry about what people are doing with requirements to make sure that you understand how much CBD are you getting in the product that you're, you're paying for. Many of them call themselves just hemp extracts made from stalk stems and seeds. The problem with that is stalk stems and seeds contain virtually no cannabinoids. That's what you're buying the product for. Without cannabinoids, it won't work. So I end up having to do my due diligence in terms of quality, where the hemp is sourced, how it's being processed, how it's being extracted. If a company doesn't know what they're selling, how would you be able to be trusting them that they have the right product for your patients. Based in Palm Springs and sourced in Colorado, Imbue Botanicals is bringing CBD products to our pharmacy shelves, health food stores, and online marketplaces, and leading the industry in accountability and quality for the benefit of human and animal consumers alike. The founding, the formulation of Imbue was really quite by accident. You know, necessity is the mother of invention. Well, in this case, it not only spawned products, but it literally spawned a company. I suffer from a condition called neuropathy. And when you get an attack, a neuropathy attack, it literally feels like somebody's pounding nails into your feet. It is just absolutely unbearable. So it finally got to a point where the doctor said, look, Tom, there's nothing else we can do for you. We had you on all the medications. Nothing's working anymore. Uh, our suggestion is that you go on opioids, pain pills for the rest of your life. <laughs> It was not a good answer for me. Just about that time, a friend of mine sent me some high CBD lotion, and I put it on my feet and went, wow, this feels better. Um, so what we did is basically start looking at this whole area, quickly gravitated towards hemp. I first developed the topicals, the lotions, and the salve, and then got into the orals, like tinctures and our, our capsules, one of my absolute favorites. I use our, our salve and, and lotions twice a day, and I have almost virtually neuropathy free. So this has been just an absolute life changer for me. Colorado has always been important in the industry overall. Um, it's specifically important to imbue. The rich agricultural nutrients and soil that's in Southern Colorado plays a key role. Uh, but the altitudes uh, mean, mean much more to us. Uh, we grow at high altitudes uh, purposely to, to get more of that UVA, UVB light. UVA being the key factor there because it really drives up uh, the cannabinoid profiles that are in the plant. We're 100% organic, we're non-GMO, you know, we're gluten-free, we're vegan, um, we're cruelty-free. That's very important to us, but most important to the consumer. I believe Imbue has um, more commitment to the efficacy of their product and assuring that they are finding the top research to support what works and why it works. And that makes them different than most CBD companies. So CBD has been a life-changing experience for these patients. I do trust Imbue because of their quality. Their formulation is very simple. There's no other fillers, and that makes a huge difference in terms of picking Imbue and being comfortable into the recommending to the patients. I want patients to fully experience the benefit of CBD. 
Right, in order to do that, they have to get the right product, and Imbue definitely delivers on that. My favorite story so far is two that coincide with each other. Um, one happens to be a Doberman, one happened to be a Shih Tzu, which also was a older dog but had osteosarcoma. Bone cancer is usually a death sentence for a dog. You know, we do the best to keep them comfortable. There are some chemotherapy options. There's no cure for it. Both of these patients and their owners decided to go and check out alternative therapies, and they did use CBD. And in my experience with both of these cases, both of these animals lived to be eight to 10 months post when they were diagnosed with this, and they were comfortable, and they had quality of life through that whole time. And that was probably the first time that I started saying, you know, gosh, there's, there's really gotta be something to this. We have everything from capsules to tinctures to lotions to salves, beauty products like face cream, eye cream, lip balm, the products for uh, dogs, for cats, for horses. And whether you're trying to find something for yourself or a family member or one of your furry family members, we've got the products for you. For more on the complete line of Imbue Botanical products, visit www.imbuebotanicals.com. For those who know, Imbue Botanicals.